And Jesus said the famous Shema prayer, Hear, O Israel, the Lord your God is God alone. Love your God with all your heart, with all your strength, and with all your soul. Good morning, family and friends. In today's Gospel, we see a scribe came to Jesus and asked him, Which of all is the greatest commandment? A scribe, a lawyer who should know what is the most important law, came to Jesus and asked him this question, What is the most important commandment? Why, first of all? A scribe should know that, yeah? Maybe the scribe was sincere and he wants to know because there were so many interpretations, more than 600 Sabbath laws and each minute interpretations given by different rabbis. So he wants to make sure he is on the right path. And Jesus said the famous Shema prayer, Hear, O Israel, the Lord your God is God alone. Love your God with all your heart, with all your strength, and with all your soul. Is that really possible? To loving God with all our effort? Yes, it is possible when we realize that we are created for love, just loving God. And He has created that vacuum within us, emptiness, to fulfill that longing for Him. And unless and until that we fill that emptiness with God alone, we will be still looking for different things to fill it with. And we see the nature, you look at the nature, even the animals and inanimate things, they strive their, their 100%, give their full to survive, to protect their children, yeah, their offspring. They give everything, yeah. And Jesus said, the Shema prayer, then he added one thing. In loving your neighbor as yourself, these are the two commandments, he said. It's like two sides of one coin. Yeah, reflects loving God, just outflows, and the outflow of that real, true, sincere love is loving our neighbor. And loving our neighbor, how? as yourself, as we love ourselves. Which means, we, by loving God, we honor ourselves, we acknowledge that we are creatures of God. Created in the image and likeness of God. So love is the most important thing. Yeah, two commandments, loving God and loving our neighbor. Nobody is perfect till you fall in love with that person. Love is the bridge that turns an enemy into a friend, said by Martin Luther King Jr. May God bless us. Amen.